team, she asked me for a playlist and she said, oh, can you create a playlist? And I was expecting like you, this playlist to be playing in the, in the exhibition because I actually like typed the playlist and, and I sent it to her. So I arrived at Palais de Tokyo in 2016 and I walked down in the basement. There's this humongous, beautiful, red, kind of like shocking uh, room. Um, and there was not my playlist playing. <laughs> and then there was this rubble like uh, bricks on, on the floor water dripping and silence and Nina's moan one song playing can you imagine like a whole room red with ruins and I was looking and searching for the playlist and I see you on one wall and I see the napkin I'm like oh my gosh okay there it is and I start to read the playlist I start to feel the emotion because she had asked me to make a playlist of the saddest song at that time that I was feeling. And at that time I was playing love, it was 2016, and I was trying to tell the story of South Africa, trying to tell the story of uh, music, so playing in a lot of different clubs and hotels and playing Afro House, Disco, Guaito, and political songs while people were sitting, eating dinner, playing at the Ritz. <laughs> it, it just kind of like reminded me of um, Jero Sokoto, how Jero Sokoto was paying 